In the previous episode, uh, you saw me leaving Jacksonville in a very, very kind of bad weather. It was raining. And five hours down to Miami, 30, 40 minute flight to the Bahamas. And it looks gorgeous. People drive on the left side, which is slightly confusing. Then I went to Monica Beach where I saw Kong for the first time in its natural shell. Well, uh, so far I went in the morning, grabbed some uh, Dunkin' Donuts for breakfast. Didn't film there. And uh, I was about to go to Monocue Beach, which I finally remembered. Uh, I don't know why it's called Monocue. It's uh, spelled Montego, but whatever. Uh, and I decided to actually come back home, uh, record my video for my financial channel. And then I'm gonna go to a downtown. I'm gonna get a ride because it's hour and a half walk, which I don't mind is just, uh, I mind it, so. It's just, I did not take my binoculars, which I, after many years of wanting binoculars, I finally bought one. Um, it's, I think they're 70 bucks or something. And these binoculars, you can attach the attachment to your phone. Give me a second, I'll show you if I find it. I also went to a very, uh, very store, very close by store, bought some sugar, creamer, and they didn't have coffee, but that guy gave me coffee. He said somebody gave it to him, it's for free, and I left him four or five dollars for it because he, he did me a favor. Uh, things are not cheap. Those two things are six dollars, uh, six fifty or something. So I left him ten for the coffee, but they're de things are definitely not cheap. There you go, he gave me this coffee, it's from Nestle. I showed him what I'm looking for. They didn't have the three in one coffee. But uh, things are expensive, guys, in Nassau. Oh, and another thing I forget for third time or second time when I go on a trip, toothpaste. Uh, also, I just forget to buy it when I was into that store. So now when I go downtown, I'll buy toothpaste. So about the binoculars, this is a peephole thing. You somehow install it on your phone. It's a bit of an adjustment here. I think I want to crush my phone a little bit more, but okay. And the phone has been able to see far. I mean, now it's <laughs> it's too close, but pretty good. You can take pretty good pictures. I'm guessing. Actually, I don't know. Gotta try. Oh wow! Okay. Yeah. I don't know if I can show it, but this is the fan. Hold on, try to. Where is the fan? There you go. <laughs> okay, I'll play with that later. Unfortunately, today's uh, diving, uh, snorkeling, actually not diving event, got cancelled because low participation. I think I already explained that, but. I'm gonna go and explore the city a little bit. So join me in this journey. We're gonna go to some historic, we're gonna go downtown. We're gonna see uh, a few things that I have on my list. Hope you guys enjoy it. Hit like and sub, you know the drill. All right, let's go. Oh yeah, and um, I have like a, I don't have a driver, but uh, the, the girl that picked me up from the airport, uh, she's busy today, so I gotta walk. It's hour and a half. I mean, it's 30 minutes to my first destination uh, where we went yesterday to Manicu Beach uh, and to the, the fort there. And then there's about an hour from that point to downtown. But what are you gonna do? I can, uh, <laughs> I guess I can skip gym and uh, I can walk. Well, this is Monica Beach. And if you remember how it looked last night, it did not look appealing. And now it looks, wow, just wow. Right, this is Monocue Beach. I don't know why the locals say Monocue. It doesn't have a Q in it, but uh, as you're in today. Weirdly enough, there's nobody here. I guess the locals don't like living in paradise. I don't know. To me, this is amazing. Uh, just for me, uh, Florida has beaches like that, but uh, I don't know, man. It's just, it's just awesome. Now let's go see the fort that I, we didn't see yesterday and uh, I'm gonna grab a salad or something 
from that bar that was closed yesterday. Basically everything I couldn't do yesterday, I'll do today. Oh, I forgot to mention, right there, so this is Monique Beach, right there are the conch and other stuff and fish and it just stinks like fish a lot. Uh, but it does not blow over the beach, which is good. But yeah, if you go and visit there guys, it, the stench is, is real. All right, that's Monique Fort. Just gonna go inside and explore a little bit. And while we're exploring, I want to read you what I found on Wikipedia about it and pretend that I knew that information. Unfortunately, as I can see, it is closed. I guess due to COVID, due to COVID they're not open. I don't know, because that's the only entrance I see. So I'm just guessing that they're closed. Well, hopefully I find some pictures online and uh, I can show you those. But in the meantime, I see a bar right there that I'm gonna check out. Oh, I think I told you already, the bar that was closed yesterday. When the next customer comes... Oh, damn. So guys, I'm right in front of the distillery, uh, John something, I'm sitting here on the sidewalk eating this fucking amazing salad, Kong salad, and having my drink, but I'll take you there in a second. This gentleman put just a little bit of pepper, and he's like, you like heat? And I'm like, yeah, hey, hey, me, hey, me, heat, who are you talking to, motherfucker? He put a little, he didn't put extra. He just put a little bit. I don't know what he put, but that he is enough. Mm. It's just enough, okay? Finish the whole salad. I think I'm not gonna eat until tomorrow. That thing's awesome. And if you great, maybe it's because of the cocktail, I don't know. But uh, but yeah, the salad was amazing. It was huge, man. That's that's. I don't know. That's amazing, and I it doesn't taste fishy in any way. It, it just it was great. I'm I'm mind blown to be honest with you. I have one more cocktail to finish, and then we're gonna go to the distillery. All right. So after I finish my sit down right there, eating my salad, uh, we go into the distillery, Jones Watling's distillery. Let's see what that has to offer for us. Maybe it wasn't a good idea to drink before you go to a distillery, but let's see how, how bad it can get.